Hi, my name is Patrick Reagan. Welcome to the Operating Systems Linux where we cover how to install, manage, and use the Linux operating system. In part 13, we finish the Linux series by discussing how to configure and manage Linux printers. While not much information is actually covered on the a exam, if you are to support Linux computer in an enterprise environment, users will eventually have a need to print. Therefore, this video covers the built-in printer applications, CUPS, and SMB client. If you have not already, subscribe to the Pat Has Your Back channel. Modern versions of Linux supports a large variety of hardware devices such as mice, printers, scanners, PCMCI, card bus, express cards, and USB devices. Most of the devices are not required while installing the system. USB hardware generally works fine. Linux supports local and network printers. And nearly all network desktops have a user-friendly printer configuration management tool to configure and manage printers. And when you click to add printers and settings, it will most likely detect the printer and automatically add the appropriate drivers. The primary mechanism for most Linux distributions, Mac OS X systems, and other Unix-like operating systems is the common Unix printer system, or CUPS. This was developed by Apples Incorporated. CUPS is the printer subsystem for Linux, which is comparable to the Windows print spooler and print drivers. CUPS manages print jobs and queues and provides network printing using the standard Internet Printer Protocol, or IPP, while offering support for a very large range of printers from dot matrix to lasers and many in between. CUPS also supports PostScript Printer Descriptions, or PPD, and Auto Detection Network Printers and features a simple web-based configuration and administration tool. The common Unix printer systems can be accessed via the browser HTTP colon whack whack localhost colon 631. To install CUPS on Ubuntu, you would use the following command, sudo apt install CUPS. The common Unix printer system service behavior is configured through the directives contained in the file slash etc slash CUPS slash CUPSSD.conf. The first time you print to a printer, CUPS creates a queue to keep track of the current status of the printer and any pages you have printed. Every time you print something, CUPS creates a job which contains the queue you are sending the print to, the name of the document you're printing, and the page descriptions. When CUPS gets a job for printing, it determines the best program, filters, print drivers, port monitors, and backends to convert the pages into a printable format and then runs them to actually print the job. When the print job is completely printed, CUPS removes the job from the queue and moves on to any other jobs you have submitted. You can also be notified when the job is finished or if there's any errors during printing in several different ways. To connect to a local printer, you would open settings and click printers. The connected printer should be detected and the driver should automatically be installed. If you need to connect to a network printer based on SMB, you need to install SMB client. sudo apt-get install SMB client. To connect to a remote printer, you would open settings and click printers, and then click add printer. To connect to a remote printer, you would in the text box at the bottom specify the IP address. Double click the server requires authentication, specify username and password and click unlock. Click add. Find and click the appropriate driver and click select. If it did not connect to the printer, you can try clicking additional printer settings and then specify the appropriate protocol and specify the necessary information. Common printer protocols developed for Unix is LPR and LPD. LPR stands for Line Print Requester and LPD stands for Line Print Daemon. 
These printer protocols were developed for the Berkeley printer system and the BSD Unix operating system. LPR is used on small number of printers under specific circumstances, while most printers use raw to send print jobs directly to a printer. LPR LPD printer is supported by most hardware, but it offers less error handling support than other options. Internet Printing Protocol, or IPP printing, allows you to send and manage print information from a variety of remote sites by sending print information over the internet or intranet. IPP is a versatile printing method and is supported by a variety of printers and network adapters. Like all IP-based protocols, IPP can run locally or over the internet. IPP uses TCP with port 631 as it is a well-known port. You can click the settings buttons for the printer to access, printer options, printer details, use printer by default, and remove printer. The printer options allows you to print a test page. To see and manage the print queue, click the job button. If you need to share the printer with SMB, you would open the SMB comp file with the command sudo nano slash etc slash samba slash smb.conf. In the global section, first look for the line that starts printing equals and change it to printing equals cups. If the line is not present, add the line. Next, locate the printer section and make sure it looks what is shown on the screen. Question, what is the printer mechanism used in Linux? Answer, cups. Question. What components used to connect to an SMB printer? Answer. SMB client. Question. What printer protocols were associated with Unix printing? Choose all that apply. Answer, LPD and LPR. For more information, visit these sites. In summary, Linux supports local and network printers. Nearly all Linux desktops have a user-friendly printer configuration management tool to configure and manage printers and when to click to add printers and settings. It will most likely detect the printer and automatically add the appropriate drivers. The primary mechanism for most Linux distributions, Mac OS X systems, and other Unix-like operating systems is the common Unix printer systems, or CUPS. LPR stands for Line Printer Requester and LPD stands for Line Print Daemon which are developed for the Berkeley printer systems in the BSD Unix operating system. Internet Printing Protocol, or IPP, printing allows you to send and manage print information from a variety of remote sites by sending print information over the internet or intranet. Thank you for watching this video. This completes the Linux series. 
The next series will be Mac OS. If you have not already, don't forget to subscribe to Pat Has Your Back channel. Thank you.